Hey, everybody, welcome back. Another sweet, sweet stream in DayZ. Let's make sure we have everything we need. I learned a trick yesterday. Is that your weapon swaps out of your backpack slot a lot faster than it does your shoulder. So... We're going to put the Kavari on our shoulder, and we're going to keep the backpack slot occupied by the auto shotgun, because that seems to be the one that gets us the most out of trouble. As you can see, we have some stuff. Here's our new kit. Let's get that key out of our hand so we can see the kit. Look at that. We had to go with the regular Tiger Stripe shirt and pants again green balaclava green goggles but this is a different pattern forget what it's called nwu so i bought as much as i could in nwu the rest is uh trying to make up i don't know olive green match the rest of the camo the only other exceptions are the backpack and the belt, because I thought this was cool as hell. Look at that backpack. That's called the Lewis Wellington. And then we have the belt. It's called the white sticker pattern. I don't know if you could see it too well, but it's kind of like a... A gray camo with red molly threading on it. It's cool as hell. Mad this dog! This is bad! This is very, Stephen very a. bad! What you talking about, homie? What are you on about, sir? Oh, I don't have one now. The server owner hasn't gotten back to me about the, uh... The useless truck there in the garage. You know what? Before we get too far, I want to give it one more shot. So, add. <laughs> I bought this key because I lost my truck key diving out of the helicopter on the last one. I was hoping that I could reprogram a key. So I bought a new key, right? So now I got this new key. It won't let me start it. We have a mint condition. Absolutely. Gem Mint 10. Range Rover. And it's just a giant trophy. It's a paperweight. Don't do shit. Jesus, man. He really did go ham today. Mad Dog going off. Need to turn a little bit that direction so we can catch those bots out there in the woods. I'm heading towards Radix, buddy. I'll be there probably a, right around 10 minutes. 5 to 10. I'm about 1,200 meters out, and I have some scum that I have to clear from the earth.
Oh, I decided to stop fucking with those, uh, little red CMS kits, too. Those sons of bitches. Every time I used it, even though it showed disinfected, it gave me blood poisoning. I'm assuming that's a glitch, but, uh... I ain't trying to fuck with it. I don't need to carry more... more injectors on me, especially the blood ones. Those are like 500k. I get that there's a trade-off. It's gonna... I hope it's a glitch and not a balancing issue. Treat multiple bleeds with the CMS kit, but then get a blood infection every single time. I hope that's not for balance. <clears throat> there they are. I can already see them. Come here, scumbags. I saw him right near those trees. Where'd you go, you scummy bastards? Ah, oh, there you are. There you are. How does that feel? You got your friend killed. Dude stepped right in front of that round meant for the guy in the back and I clipped him in the face through the bushes. Let's get this ready in case any of them decide that they're gonna stand up. Oh, there they are. They're way back in here. Fellas. What are you doing in here? Boots and belts, boys. I want your boots. And your belts. Is there one more? I only see three. Missing one somewhere. Give me that. Okay, I lied. It's boots, belts, and balaclavas. Balaclava. This son bitch was trying to engage me with a Glock 19 at like 300 yards. Okay, it's probably more like 150 meters, but still. The other guy was still kind of like chilling. He was walking when I. or was he? Where'd that fourth guy go? Where did he go? Thought he was over here to the left. He maybe wasn't that far to the left. Is he over here to the right? How do I always lose one of them? Like, every time. Every time. Is he further back? Is that him over there? Oh shit! What are you doing all the way back here, buddy? With your Thompson Mark II.
Dude was coming at me like an Al Qaeda fighter. Trying to shoot me from fucking 200 meters with the shortest barrel weapon with the one of the highest cyclic rates. Those rounds were going nowhere near where he thought they were. <clears throat> I did not hear that weapon fire though, so I might have killed him before he had a chance. I heard the Glock and I heard the 527. The CR 527. Well, that was a quick, what, 250 rep? 300, almost? That's nice. I think those fellows are worth 60 rep apiece. Wonder if there's anyone up at the uh the checkpoint up here on the road. A new what? A new sniper? Yeah, bro, I don't know. I like this, uh... This scope here is pretty fucking tight. The Night Force 12X. I'm a fan. Oh, a Gavar. Yeah. The Gavar is a tight rifle, bro. I like it. The Night Force 12X on the Honey Badger? For what? <laughs> you trying to shoot individual button loops on dudes' fucking shirts? Trying to split hairs on their testes? Yeah, I saw that short. That was awesome. Sent dude to space with that nade on his vest. Ah! Well, I'd be lying if I said I was looking for it. <laughs> well, yeah, kinda. The overall goal is to keep some distance from those fellas. Because they, they can be a motherfucker. Let me eat this whole ass can of beans right now. Where am I driving to, Mad Dog? South? Nadbor? Yeah, I wasn't going to start any missions. Nadbor indeed. Okay, give me a few moments. I've got this uh, food and drink issue i got to sort out real quick.
and then I gotta remove dead guy's stuff from my inventory. <laughs> hey, Steve! What's up, buddy? Welcome. Oh, this can of pork got ruined. Didn't even notice that. I shot him through his can of pork chunks. The pork chunklets. And even then, it couldn't save him from a 338. ITC helped you. What's ITC? Or who is ITC? Oh, itchy! Yeah, nice. That's cool. Let's see, what am I running? I forgot what I have. Thompson Mark II, okay. Saw those MPXs. So the rest of these Tommies. The Tammies. Build a wall that's 1.5 meters off the floor. What? You're not making sense, mate. I guess I'm not selling flashlights anyway. That's fine. No, I'm keeping that too. Let's see what else I gotta... I can actually get rid of these MPX mags. P90 mag. The Vepper mag. Yeah, I know I'm not using any L cans. That can go. Eh. Nope, keeping all that. Clothing. Let's first toss our boots on the floor so we don't sell those. Jungle boots. back on. Military clothing. Belts. Masks. Sell their balaclavas. Backpacks. Utility butt pack. That is a huge utility butt pack. A hundred storage spots. Holy hell. I don't think I have any more modded clothing. Oh, I got it. I have an exorbitant amount of Thompson Mark II mags, though. Oh, shit. There's helicopter shit that I meant to leave at the house. Fuck. Oh, well. If it fits, it ships, right? Where'd the hoses go? There they are. The hoses. What? All right, so cool. 
cool, cool. The man is moving. Snafu mags. Let's sell three of those. Watch it sell the ones that I wanted to keep. Oh no! It didn't. It sold the other ones. Fantastic. Let's sell these dog tags. Not bad. I bruised up eight of those clowns. And scored... 950k. Alright. <laughs> Let me show you what my bank is at after buying all this gear. I haven't been at lower than 10 mil in forever. One point one five mil for that that beamer. The beamer. What's its storage? Four hundred? Eh. It's only a hundred better than the Range Rover, but It might not be compatible with the NVGs that you were trying to attach. That might be the issue. Certain gear only takes certain attachments. The Vodnik? This thing? This thing is fast as hell? Get out of here. It looks like a f fucking turd. All right, helis, all the way to the right, the UH-1H, that's the one I rescued. After I bailed out of it, I ended up getting it back to the house, but I crashed it in the trees. I think I'd want to roll the Merlin. Yeah, this thing was slow compared to the Little Bird. Very slow. But that was better. It was easier to uh, control. It just, like any helicopter, it's hard as fuck to land and steer. So one more time, Mad Dog, is the BMW storage expandable? Does it take boxes and shit? Or no? I think I'm just going to buy a range again. I like my off-road range. Oh. Let's go to blue. Gotta have a blue one. There we go. There's that key. So this one... Remove the tag from... Add the tag to this one. Make that one number eight on the hot bar. And then, uh, let's see, vehicle parts. We'll throw this on the ground. Come into here. Only show me the sellables.
Wow, I can't believe I spent 500k on that car key. That's insane to me. Alright. I'm gonna make a deposit. Actually. No, well, yeah, sure. I'll just buy another can of that. Yo, that I'm I say it every time. The the balance with the food and the drink needs to be addressed. Alright, man, I'm down. I'm down for it. I need a good farm. A thousand dollars. Why do I need a thousand dollars on me? Oh, that's 10,000. Whoops. That's... Oh. God damn it. That's what happens when you sleep in. Now I can't math. Alright. Let's observe the map. How do we get to Nadbor? Without driving through too many towns. I got a thousand. I'm not worried about a thousand bucks. If I lose it, I lose it. So... I'm gonna make a right. Go down there to the left. That's going to take us through Osanka. Luckily, it's not through a major part of town. Yeah, there's a, a thousand slot bag. Oh, shit. I think we'll stay on the main road and avoid driving right through the center. What the fuck is this? Oh, that's a... That looks like a quarry or something. Alright. So this is Nadbor. I'm gonna make a mark here. I'm gonna call it... Divergence. I think that's spelled wrong. Divergent. That's definitely spelled wrong. Divergence? I think that's how you spell it. That's where we're going to get to on the road, and then we're going to cut through the fields. Try to dodge through the main part of town. Alright. Yeah, some of those operator shirts are fucking incri- like, insane. Life of a 12-year-old, that's- is that you, Itchy? How's everybody doing today? We got some numbers going up today. Oh, tech! That's what. Tech. Yeah, that. Your new name on YouTube throws me way off.
Someone just took a suppressed shot at us from the woods. Yeah, man, you gotta show me that strat. You gotta show me that strat for sure. Nobody. Just me. map check Where the hell are we oh we're going the wrong way we need to make that left that's why we do map checks Yes, Tech. It is Livonia. This is the Omega Tech server. Omega Tech has many servers, almost every map. Um, I remember something about a dirt road. Did we want to take the dirt road? No, the dirt road takes us right through town. We'll stay paved and then we'll make that right at the end. Anyway, Omega Tech has nearly every map as a server. And, uh, what is it? The ones they're missing, PNW. They're missing Bitterroot. And I think there's one more that they're not affiliated with. But they've got Chernaris, uh, Summer and Winter. They have a Deer Isle, a Livonia, obviously. But the mod packs they use are just... They're fucking incredible. I love the mod packs. Associated with this, uh... This guy's servers. DayZ2? There's a DayZ2? That was fucking weird. Did you see that? That can't be grass. It's like this weird little glowing spot right there. How do you get all of the ads, Mad Dog? That's weird. I've never heard of it. Day Z2. I'm going to have to steam that later on. Look it up. Hopefully it's not a... Uh, one of those scams. With the, uh... The day before... Someone, 
uh, took the game, they took all of the code from the Steam page, made a duplicate Steam page, and then attached a like a shitty little point and clicky game to it. Nice. Holy shit. Left. Just show me the traders up there. Right. Yeah, I'm going. I was just trying to figure out how to get in there. Which building it was exactly. I just heard an explosion. I'm sure there's bandit boys circling this joint too. There always seems to be dirty bandit boys. No way they were shooting at me. Dirty bandit pricks. Did you guys hear that missile fly overhead? One of those gas... Son of a bitch. One of those gas rockets. Alright, let's not make it easy for him to hit us. Alright, two seconds. I gotta get up. I'll be right back. You're killing me, Mad Dog. Really? Go accept the mission for fish? Fish. This is how you get the rep. This is how you farm the rep and the money. It's only $50,000. Hold up. Hold up. No fucking way. 20 bucks a piece and they're gonna pay me 50... Oh my god. 
My bag is empty. My shirt's empty. Alright, well, I guess let's buy 12 of each. <clears throat> what do you mean the wrong one? Fishing? What kind of place is this? It's the same thing. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> That's fucking stupid. That's so fucking stupid. <laughs> oh my god. Hey, question though. Did you accept that, uh... Did you accept that one mission down there at Radix? For those boys in the house? No, escape that. Misclicked. Oh, I don't have any any more fish. Fish. Well, yeah, we're already up to 16k rep. I bet we can hold 20 of each. Let's try 24. Let's try 28. 32 36 Oh, okay, that's it. We're full. What the fuck? This is obscene, bro. This is absolutely obscene. Well, everybody, here we are. We've become hackers. <laughs> Thank you, Mad Dog. Oh yeah, we gifting. And now that we are in Nadbor, I mean, after we're done with this, we're going to uh, hunt around the area, try and find some of these southern military spots and 
ice down these uh, bots that are hanging around up here. Oh, ran out of fish. How much money do we have? <clears throat> we started with a thousand. And then we wasted like six, seven hundred of it. We're up to 847,000 already. And we know we can hold 40 of each fish. It's fucking silly. Now we're up to 17,000 rep. You know, I can't tell if Lieutenant Sato is male or female. This is stupid. This is so stupid. Oh. Making that money back. We are making our money back. And then we're out of fish. The, the growth rate of our cash is now exponential. So, what I have noticed is that it doesn't matter really what mission you do. You're going to get 50,000 bucks and 100 rep for each one. It doesn't matter what the mission is. Like, at the lake. With those nine banded assholes. I got the rep from killing all of them and their their backup buddies, all like 30 of them that were there. And then I got the money from all the, the crap I took off their bodies to sell. But when I turned in the mission, it was 100 rep and $50,000. Let's make this fast. There's three on me. By 37 more. Okay. I think I'd actually like it more if the menu just stayed open. Okay. 
Don't you clap in my face. Chicken breasts. Look at that. 100 rep. $50,000. Every single one of them. This one requires less stuff, though. Let's sell the rest of these fish. Well, how many fish do we have left? Whoa! <laughs> Look at all that money. We're going to have to make a deposit. Okay, that was our last round of fish. How much is it for chicken breasts? Eight bucks a piece. So, completing that mission is only going to cost us $16, and it's going to get us 50000 As opposed to the fish mission, which costs us $1,600. Oh, uh, shit. Let's buy a hundred of them. A hundred chicken breasts for eight hundred dollars. Uh, too bad Mad Dog just logged off. I think he would like this one a lot better. That's disrespectful. You see him? You see how he's clapping? He's putting those fucking hands like right up in my shit. Like he's trying to to pancake my nose. That's that disrespectful shit. No, my dog came to visit. Hey, babies, who's your little sweetie? Go on, go lay down. Nope, not that one. Yeah, this chicken one is better. It's little details. If it's all going to get you $50,000 and 100 rep. Making money is so easy. How many more chicken breasts do I have on me? I don't even know. I bought enough chicken to do this quest 50 times. Oh god, we're already up to 22,000 rep. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> well, here's a test. Can we accept multiple quests at the same time? Oh, we sure can.
How many more times do I have? Holy hell. Let's... Okay. Now, cancel that one. I'm gonna get carpal tunnel just moving my my mouse around so small. <clears throat> Mad dog. Hey, do you see this? Do the chicken, not the fish. Fuck the fish. The chicken gives you the exact same rep and money. From the meat box, man. I bought enough chicken to do this mission 50 times, and it only cost me 800 bucks. Yeah, you could buy chicken. Have you not ever explored the, the consumables box? <laughs> ah. Just like I never thought to do this. I knew the meat was there, but... I didn't think you could buy it from the machine and then go and turn it in. I thought it was going to force you to go and catch it. I can't even remember how many times I've done this now. But yeah, I bought a hundred chicken breasts. They're eight dollars each. So that was eight hundred bucks. Eight hundred bucks for a hundred chicken breasts. Enough to do this mission fifty times. That alone is like... What is it? It's either 2.5 million or 25 million. I think it's 2.5 mil. And then, obviously, 10,000 rep. Oh, that's it. That's the bottom of my chicken. Yeah, consumables, meat, chicken steaks. Eight bucks each. Look at that. You know, before we do that, though, I think we need to make a deposit. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! We turned a thousand dollars into 4.84 million. And I am not going to try and math that at all. We're back up over double digit numbers now. That's great. That's great. Let's buy another hundred chickens. And get ourselves some carpal tunnel syndrome. Forty-nine. Forty-eight. Forty-seven. Forty-six. Yeah, we're, uh... We're on our way to some money and some rep. Look at that, 25.5 now. We've got the rep. We're going to be at 35,000 by the time we're done with this. Did... What? The Honey Badger is awesome in 
I did just over 1,500 in K. Oh. Yeah, dude, this is... This is the way to go. Is this mission at the Radix Trader? It might just be here, huh? <laughs> Stupid consumables. I don't think they meant for this when they made the mod. But I'm okay with it. So for $800, we're going to make... 2.5 million and we're gonna go from what was that 23,000 ish rep 22 23 to 32 33 obscene and to think I was doing this shit the hard way setting hasty ambushes for the bots Tagging them out in the open whenever I could. Handling business everywhere I went. Or getting handled. Fucking sucker. Grinding it out the hard way. Shit. Well, we're up to 28.5, so I think we're about halfway there. Well, at least he doesn't clap in my face every time. <laughs> Play proper for a day and then abuse the fuck out of it. Yeah, that seems legit. Hey, look, the great Todd Howard said, it's not a bug, it's a feature. Yeah, man, I need, I need way, way, way more practice with a chopper before I would be comfortable enough to use it regularly. Damn it. I need to hit up and hit the right, get up and hit the restroom again. I'll be right back.
All right, back to the grind. I guess you could call it grinding in two different ways. Hey, yeah. Unlimited helis to learn from. We're gonna catch a server ban. Not from doing this, I don't think. I think what we would get banned for is, uh... The copious amounts of abandoned vehicles all over the map. You know, like, there's gonna be a hill right near this, uh... Right near the trader, there's gonna be a hill. Right? So, I, I bet the vehicle trader's, like, out here. So, this hill here, <laughs> this tree line, would just be littered with broken helicopters from when I try to take off and smash into these trees. Just upside down helicopters all over the map. Jesus. I was right. It's 2.5 million. All for the small price of 800 bucks. meat chicken steak give me hundreds of them Yeah, that hill. That hill would be covered in upside down helis and Range Rovers from me trying to get the helis back and leaving them on the hill as well. <laughs> yeah, man. This is, this is even more genius than what I had in mind. Though, check this shit out. My way almost yields better results. Right? So each time I complete this, you don't have to do much, you don't have to go very far. Yada, yada, yada. I get that. Well, it takes longer, but you get more results, too. So, each of those bandits is worth 60 rep. Right? You don't have to run away very far for them to respawn. You only have to go, like, 30, 40 meters out. And then when you turn around and come back, they're, they're all respawned. So each, each time you kill the four bandit boys, that's 240 rep. You're not making $50,000 off of what you can sell from them. But if all you're after is rep, then my way would be better for that. Because that's 240 rep every time you clear a group of these assholes and only takes like 15, 20 bullets. Depending on the weapon you're using. I can usually get two of them with the Kavari. I take one with the SA-58. Uh, either take two of them with the SA-58 or take two of them with the shotgun. With the shotgun, it's like four more rounds. So that's six total rounds. 
With the SA-58, it's like three or four rounds apiece. Oh, I'm not hating. This, this is absolutely genius. Yeah, Uncle Woozy! Long time no see, buddy! Welcome! Hope you're doing well. Hope everything is good. Hell yeah, it is a, a spending spree kind of day. We actually had one of those at the... I'm not going to say the end of the last stream. It was after the end of the last stream. All the shit that I'm wearing now cost me about $10 million to buy because I made a stupid and did a 500 meter dive out of a helicopter. And now I have a fucking paperweight of a truck in my garage. And all this talk about chicken breasts make me hungry. Maybe some nice baked lemon pepper chicken. Oh yeah, that's the plan. I'm trying to I'm trying to talk, be interesting, keep everybody engaged, and brainstorm new house ideas. Oh, that was it. Ran out of chicken. What am I up to in rep? 35,000. I've got 16 million. This will be the last one. I know it's got to be getting hard to watch at this point. Yeah, luckily I had a head start. I was already up to, uh, what did we start at? 15,400 or something like that? Huh. Yeah, this takes... This takes forever. We got military bases to go scope out. We got our range. 
I'm gonna snap on some of that Mark V armor too. Oh man, we gotta. We might have to do this two more times. Well, what is it? Uh, all of that MMG shit is super expensive, is why. No, you get the same amount of money for fish, bro. You get the, it's the same reward, no matter the mission. We got the same reward for all of that headache at the lake. You remember those nine fucking guys at the lake that you had to kill? Yeah. After you killed those nine guys at the lake, you got a hundred reputation and fifty thousand dollars. You're getting the same reward for killing nine guys at the lake and dealing with that headache as you are for selling two chicken breasts. There's a balance issue with the rep. And no, actually, Mad Dog, the chicken is cheaper. Huh. The chicken only costs $800 for a hundred breasts. The fish was $800 for 40, 40 pieces. With the chicken, it's a $800 for a hundred pieces. The fish was $800 for 40 pieces. So I'm over here turning this in. With 100 chicken breasts, I get 50 opportunities to finish the mission. But with the fish, you had to carry four of each, which costed you 1600 bucks and only gave you 10 opportunities to finish. So you end up making more trips back and forth to the machine. The chicken is the, the superior choice. That black armor is a million bucks a piece. I think. Yeah, the vest I have now was like four or five hundred thousand. And this is just the TT plate carrier that you could take off the uh, the bots. But you only get the black one from the bots, and I wanted a cool color. So I'm keeping my helmet. I might sell the nods. Yeah, dude, who knows? I might actually be, at this point, close to how many times you've done it. Or way over how many times you've done it. I'm about to crack 40,000 rep. Oh. Uh. 
if it don't come in this cool color, Mad Dog, I don't want it. This NWU November whiskey uniform pattern. How many more fucking chickens do I got, man? Oh, that was it. Let's just do this one more. Did we need to do another one? Do we need another roll? 40,201 rep. And... Nineteen point one million. That's nice. There's the modded clothing. Show me what you got, MMG. I'm eyeballing that Mark V armor. I hope it comes in this cool ass pattern. Or if it doesn't come in November whiskey uniform. The Lewis Wellington, just like my backpack. That would be tight. Look at that, 1.5 mil for this stuff. It's not that expensive. Tuh, look at this one. Look at that shit. Talk about blending in. UCP, that's... N-W-U. Yeah, buddy. Holsters. Oh, uh, but there's no N-W-U holster. It's okay. Dark Woodland works. That... That added $80,000 to Lewis Wellington pouches. Oh, they're supposed to be Louis Vuitton. I get it now. No. Holster pouch. No, we don't want a holster pouch. Camo tactical pouch. Pouch city. Oh. Oh. The white sticker one. I think we're gonna get fancy, boys. We're gonna be fancy, boys. Uh, we still got space for double mag pouches and all. Nice. I think we might have to go with Dark Woodland again. Oh, I see. The double mag pouch replaces the EOD pouch. Uh huh. -huh. So it goes in the same spot. All right. Let's keep going down the line. Oh shit! I forgot about this. The Mark V pouches. Oh, and they have it in NWU. A little butt pack. Grab 
Grenade pouch, NWU. Oh, you know it. Oh, that's sexy. Winter tactical pouch. Eh. I don't know, that kind of blends in a little bit better than that dark stuff. Though it sticks out like a sore thumb, too. Oh, there we go. Tactical pouch, NWU. Double mag pouch, NWU. That's perfect. Are the the MMG holsters down here too? Yeah, there it is. Nope, that's a holster pouch. Oh, that's right. The holsters were on a different thing. Can't believe they don't have NWU for the holster pouches. That's dumb. Stupid dumb. Livonia Special Forces, boys. Should we advertise? <laughs> Ranger! Toxic. Driver. Do they not have an O positive? Oh, there it is. That is my blood type. I did a blood test kit. Found out I'm O positive on the server. Ocean Warrior. I'm gonna go with the Punisher patch. Others! Oh, we do need a sheath. Where the fuck does that even go? Oh, it goes across the middle here. That's right. Oh, no, it doesn't. It goes right there. Kind of like the dark woodland. I'm going to save this preset. That's a wrecked vest. Hell yeah. Show me that shit. 2.122 million. Hot. Damn. Yeah. Well, that's a whole fucking round of selling fish. Just for a sick-ass vest. I think I need to remove everything from my pouches now. Where is it? Where did you go? There you are. Okay. Start moving shit over, I guess. Where's my fucking holster at? Where's all my belt shit? <laughs> Do I keep fucking just blasting by it? Tactical shirt. Tactical pants. Assault pack.
Okay. I, get, I think the game took it a whole shit. But oh, that's why. I took a whole shit. Put that in there. My god, man, look at all this storage. Is there a space on this vest for a bottle? There is not. Okay, so we're missing a bottle slot. No big deal. Let's just tuck that in there. Actually, that came off our belt. Might be sticking with that belt. Because NWU is not a pattern available for the, the Falcon belt. Otherwise, I would have bought it. They had pouches available for it in NWU. Let's put that back in there, actually. We have to buy another pistol. A pair of Model 500 competitors. What's crazy is this gun is only, like, 3,000 bucks. Alright, what else do we got? What else do I got on my vest? Let's tuck all this up so that we don't see it. And all we see is the vest. Alright. These can go in the mag pouch because they take up crazy amounts of space. Why is it giving me the drum mag for the auto shock. Oh, because I'm still wearing it. God. And then the utility pouch. 150 slots on the utility pouch. Let's move this over here. All of these. Let's put them in the grenade pouch. I take that back. Put them in the mag pouch. We can keep our loose rounds in there too. There's still plenty of space. Tactical pouch can hold our SA-58 mags. Loose rounds can go in here. So those two pouches are empty. This can go in just the base storage. Those can all get sold. Uh, okay, let's start with the tools. Compass, can opener, leather kit, gun repair kit, sharpening stone, that thing. I'm going to keep all those heli parts together. The wrench, which we'll have to buy a new one of. Heli parts can go here. Ugh. And now the med pouch. Oh. A 
Let's... Let's get our medicines in first, and then we'll put the heli parts. I'm going to want another one of those saline bags, that's for sure. That's for sure. Mm, medical. Saline IV bag. I'm sure that went into my backpack. Okay. Probably the pants then. Or the shirt. There it is. All right, this thing's empty now. We look like a fucking juggernaut. Now just show me the syllables. Now just show me the syllables. <laughs> Oh, the price doesn't change. Okay. Bam. Now. Uh, let's see. So far, I've spent $2.13 million. That vest alone was two point one two, And then I bought another saline bag for forty grand. And I guess two point one six. No, I haven't. I have not. Customize. Well, first off, let's check one more time. Make sure they don't have a NWU. They have this one. Looks a little weird. It does kind of fit, though. It fits... Almost fits better than this one. Though I do like this quite a bit. Uh, I'm going to mute the mic. The mailman came and my dog lost her fucking mind. Yeah, I don't think so. I don't believe I am. Especially when there's other options.
That balaclava looks bad as fuck. <laughs> uh, there's no NWU version, though. Who's going to be easy to see? Me? With this blue and green digital cam? I'll be blending into the bushes. Alright, let's get that. Let's look at pants. Police. Blue police pants. All your friends are zombies. You are the stereotype. Crime is money. <laughs> Look at these fucking things. They're ridiculous. It does kind of match the, the play carrier, though. I mean, it breaks up the TV kills everything. Good morning. Something all fake. <laughs> Villain. Go to sleep, citizen. The villain is you. Ah, I like these pants. 400 slot pants. Yeah, sure. What do we got here? We have an NWU shirt. We don't have a, a white sticker shirt either. What the fuck? Did they do this shit on purpose? So that you just look like... Ass? <laughs> Is... You can't even match. All I want to do is match. Was this the helmet you were talking about, too? The Mandalorian helmet? Oh, yeah, look at that shit. Look at that shit right there. Customize. Customize with black NVGs. Back head. Two million dollars for the helmet. Now let's strip it. Take these batteries off. Take the flashlight off. So I think we can attach the flashlight to this one. Yep. 
and we already have NVGs on there, so that's good to go. We could sell the combat headphones, tactical helmet. No, just show me the syllables. <coughs> Sell the headphones. I don't we still have two different other items on it? Oh, I forgot to take those off. Uh, tools, electronics, those shitty night vision goggles, put your helmet on, all right, boom, Take off your pants and jacket. Put those pants on. Hide all that. Oh, we didn't have anything in our pants. Lovely. Tuck that in there. Take the shirt off. No, we had shit in our shirt. Oh, we had everything in our shirt. And the balaclava. If these stack higher than 50, why aren't they doing so? Alright, after we're done gearing up, we're probably going to do this uh, chicken thing two more times. Let's see what color we can get on these boots. <clears throat> and then we got to get the bag, too. And I swear to God, I hope the bag has an NWU pattern. Boats. Variants and skins. Yeah, sure, let's go with the multicam blacks. Oh, wait, these tactical boots don't have a sheath slot in them, do they? Oh, they do. 
Look at that. Boop. No, I just want to see the sellables. The assault boots. Ugh. Okay. Oh, that knife went straight into the slot. Oh no, it's just been there. We still need another fang for our, uh... Let's get a combat knife. Why not? So you have a combat knife? I thought there was one in MMG shit. No, it'll be under melee weapons. Combat knife it is. Where did it go? There it is. There we go. We got so many knives, we don't know what to do with them now. Toss that off so we don't accidentally sell. Come on now. Don't tell me it's in the other one. Yeah, it's in the other one. Okay. Oh. Pistol. Buy another one. There we go. It was... Now eh, let's check out the gloves. One more again. No, I sold myself short. I could have got the operator shirt with 600 slots. And the tack pants with 500 slots. Oh well. There's tactical gloves there. Is there another set of gloves? Nope, that's the only set of gloves there is. Those are the ones I got is UCP. Those look pretty good. They're called camo, but they're like a, a black and white camo.
Hey, you know all that money we just made? Selling chicken? Yeah. It's gone now. <laughs> Backpack. That's right. Last thing. Massive slot backpack. Eight hundred slots, a thousand slots. I think that's the one we're looking for. Jesus, 900 slots in this one. Seven hundred slots. That's the one we were running. That's the one we got now, actually. A seven hundred slaughter. Eight hundred, nine hundred, a thousand. I think that's it for backpacks, right? No, there's one down here. Twelve hundred slots. <laughs> it looks like the stalker bag from Dead Side. Well, fuck. You know what time it is. Oh, it does not have a rifle slot. That is trash. That's hot ass fucking garbage. <clears throat> How the fuck are you not going to have a rifle slot? Like, for real. Whatever. We'll keep the shotgun in our armor. Now we sell this tactical pack that we got. Where is it? Seriously, where the fuck is it? Am I... Am I missing this son of a bitch altogether? No, where the hell is it? Oh, I threw it on the floor. That's why. Dumb. Sorry. We're almost at the end of our normal streaming time. Luckily, I'm on vacation. I don't have to go to work today. Now we made back some of our money from all that shit. I'll keep those tucked away. I don't need to see all that all the time. Where? Hmm. 
where there it is. I'm gonna make sure to fill up this bottle before I completely forget. We're also gonna drain the motherfucker too, right now. Keep that hydration up. And we're gonna buy another can of lunch meat and finish that off. We might even do a can of unknown food. Drank that whole bottle, didn't get a tummy ache. Which I guess is good. Consumables. Food. Buy another lunch meat. Alright. We're gonna make back 7.5 mil. I think we have the space for 300 fishes. Oh, that's a tummy ache. I forgot to look. Probably gonna end up chucking. 5, 8, 6, 2, 8. Zero nine. Oh. Uh, let's try to do four hundred. Make a straight up ten mil. Meat. 400. Oh. I thought I'd made the game take a shit. It really had to think hard about where all 400 of those fish were going to fit on me. So we got to do this 200 times. We're down to 197. We're going to be here for a minute. Worth it though. Each 100 fish at 100 rep was 10,000 rep. We're going to be at 80,000 reputation by the time we're done with this. <clears throat> Ugh. Robbing the server. Funny thing is we're still getting those HX from Omega Tech. <laughs> Just for being on here. And speaking of Omega Tech. I have been watching a tuber. Play DayZ. And he plays on a server called The Lab. And oh my lord, does The Lab look fun as hell. I think it is a Trenaris map. Yeah, I think it's a Trenaris map. 
but they have a lab, there's key cards, there's all kinds of shit. I don't know if, uh... We're gonna end up playing that anytime soon. It is intriguing to me. There is a ton of PvP, though. If you want to check it out for yourself, the tuber I've been watching is called Syl. S-Y-L. Sam Yankee Lincoln. Very entertaining stuff. Dude is a, a PvP monster. And the lab server itself. It just, it looks super fun to play on. And he plays on the EU servers because he's, uh, Dutch, I think. I think we're about 15% of the way through this now. We were at 40,000-ish rep. Getting close to, uh... Forty-five here. We are hungry and eat chicken. And all the chicken you give us, we're gonna stock into the vending machine. Can you sell us chicken so that we can fill our vending machine, please? Yeah, sure, let me just head over to your vending machine, buy all the chicken out of it, and then sell it back to you. Because apparently y'all don't know under... You don't... Know, Y'all don't understand how uh, supply and demand works. I'm gonna capitalism the shit out of you. Oh boy. Chair is sinking. Who knew selling chicken could be so exhausting? We're just like a, a chicken middleman, too. We're not even going out and hunting the chicken. <clears throat> And what Mad Dog was saying earlier, how we're going to be super visible because of our 
blue camo. I'm not really concerned about being visible to other people. The bots themselves. Now you saw Monday when we played with Ollie. As soon as we fired up that helicopter, we were taking shots from 400 meters. And even after we got out of the chopper, they were still able to, to lock on us. They couldn't hit us. And their shots were... They were impacting close, but they were wild. Not inaccurate. Or not accurate, I mean. So the bots, the bots are going to see us no matter what. They always see us first. So I don't care what ammo we're rocking. The bots always see us first. Unless we're catching them boys in the woods. And then they don't see us until we actually sight them in. How the hell are we cold? Aren't we wearing all of, like, the best insulation stuff? Let's see if there's any of those hot hands in one of these vending machines. Whoops. There we go. Oh, look, this guy's cold, too. We should take off our clothes and spoon. Lieutenant Sato. Do it for the warmth. I'm obviously larger than you, so I get to be Big Spoon. You can call me Ladle. And I will call you Teaspoon. Yeah, there's another game that's, uh... Got me intrigued to play again. After doing all of this uh, day zing, I understand a little bit more of the mechanics of how Scum operated. Now, at the time I played Scum, I wasn't... I wasn't ready for all of the thinking and strategery. Hell, I wasn't even ready for the combat. We gotta be getting close to the halfway point here. Fuck. Just see all that money. Hold on. What is that? That's our pants.
It really is too bad you can't drag and drop multiples. Quality of life. Inventory management mod. That would be awesome. Being able to drag and drop multiple items. Yo, that's one thing we're going to stop and look at, too. Right in the, um, the vending machine there. That'll look and see if there's an illicit substances workbench available for purchase. And all the, uh, associated accoutrements. So every time we get a payment from this guy, it don't stack, it just takes up two more slots. Or girl. I, I have no idea what Lieutenant Sato is. Alright, that's the money all cleaned up. That's our insane storage backpack. How many chickens do I still have? Holy shit. 328 slots out of 400 still absorbed by chicken. Oh. I take that back. There's still a buttload more chicken. Back to it. You know, Mad Dog made that comment about needing a wallet. And then he also made a comment yesterday when I was talking to him about the server fucked up and he lost all of his money. I wonder if he's using the ATM. Ugh. Why am I still hungry? Get in there. I think we have about 50 or less.
Oh, I did my math wrong. It's not 10,000 rep each. It's 5,000 rep. Okay. That's where my math was wrong. It's 5,000 rep per 100 chicken breasts. All right, real quick, how many chickens do we got left? Fuck. I think we'll be at right around 60,000 rep when we're all done with this. I think I need to turn down the DPS on my mouse too, just a little bit. I think I got it up too high again. It's been like four or five months I've had this mouse and I still haven't dialed in the DPS. TC! Buddy! Good to see you. Yeah, doing quests for money. Um. Money and rep. Let us know. We're up over 56,000. And now we can buy anything we want. We're almost done with this, though. So thanks to Mad Dog showing us a little trick it's obscene it it's borderline hacking if it wasn't for the time commitment it would be a a gen genuine hack <laughs> uh pc i'll show you in a second you play Daisy on the PC, right? Ah. Uh, I don't know. Does console allow mods? I don't know if you'd be able to access this this server from Xbox. This, this trick is specific to uh, probably this exact server and no others. It would probably be worth a shot on other servers that have traders that give quests. I don't even know the name of the mod that has the quest givers. Yeah. It's not that I did too much either for this. Once I'm done selling all this shit, I'll show you how it works. And it works for both of the quests that he has. But, uh, the chicken one. I'll just tell you real quick. Uh, 
so you you go over here to the consumables box you go down to meat you buy the chicken steaks you only need two to finish the quest so after you have your two chicken steaks you come over to this guy accept the quest for chicken and then you could turn it in right away the chicken steaks are eight bucks a piece so for sixteen dollars you can farm this guy for a hundred rep and fifty thousand dollars it's stupid it's it's absolutely stupid and I saw that I only had 18 chicken breasts left so that was nine more rolls and I think we're five in now so we should be just about at the end I think that's the last one Yep, that was the last one. Quick check our pouches. Make sure there's no more... No more chickens. Later, TC. Thanks for stopping in, even for just a moment. Damn. God damn. God damn. We are extra millionaires. Oh, I don't have any money. That's right, I just deposited it all. Whoops! <clears throat> I don't want to carry any cash on me. Eat as much of this unknown food can as we can and try to get topped up on our fucking hunger. Haven't heard them bandit boys shooting in a while either. Alright, two seconds, I'll be right back. Alrighty, alrighty, alrighty. Let's check real quick, see if our filter's on. It's not. Okay. So it's starting to be morning. Let's eat some more of this food can. So we get the tummy aches again. And then we'll check the map. Find our, uh, our next target. Tummy ache. Base building. Gardening. You can't buy the illicit substances, though. Hmm. 
And these containers are pretty basic. Armored cabinet. I bet that one there has enough space or it has specific spaces for uh, individual gear bits. Same basic containers. Doesn't appear that they sell in workbenches at all. Yeah, same shit in both of those, that's weird. Well, map time. Actually, let's finish this can of shit, then map time. Boom. Okay. Does that look like a military base to you? Looks like one to me. That actually looks like another one there, too. Hopefully it's not one of them factory farms. To be completely fair, though, we have not been this far south. Literally ever. I know... Domborg, this is the bunker. But we need the punchy card to get in. That ain't shit. That's probably just some ruins. Jezero. Again. Bunch of nothing. That looks like a camp. That might be a military camp. Is it peak low? That quarry looks interesting as fuck. Geralto. That looks like a big old military base there. Oh, nope. Not with that. That's probably a farm. Or some kind of recycling center. That's probably a military base. Little spec. Oh, what town is this next to? Rostoka. Okay. Where are we at? Here. Huh. Let's spec. Nad bore.
going to mute the mic here. I think the kids are home. scouting the map for these military locations will save us some time on the road why do these look like tiny little mill camps too I doubt we're gonna find a punch card near Domborg I just I doubt it highly wouldn't make any sense to have a, a key lock door and then allow the, the key to spawn outside the door. Alright, I think that's good enough for now. Let's, um... Yeah, let's go check out this one right quick. Just take off the 3D markers so that we don't have our uh, screen loaded up with these marker bits. Is there a way to drive out through here? Kind of looks like it. Kind of looks though like we should uh, just reverse out, can't go back out the way we came in. Check. Once we exit, go around the right. And we're just going to cut through all these 
forests and trees and woods and bullshit. Shit. You can almost see from here, that doesn't really look like a military base. Hell yeah, catching that big air. Oh no. This is a military spot. Just gonna pull in and park it. Right here. <laughs> now we got a couple of barracks. AK nineteen muzzle. Hey, maybe I'll find a shotgun choke here. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I bet there are. <laughs> hey, Mad Dog, you remember that uh, foregrip you really, really wanted? Found it. Oh, and a Mark IV hammer scope. They're shooting over there. They're teeing off on some Zambies. Let's knock on their door. See if we can get their attention. Oh, Zamboni. Smoked him. There's honestly no fucking arguing with this Kavari. This thing's a monster. shots were coming from over this way. Oh look, plate carrier. Now where did it go? Into the pants. Almost be willing to bet they're either in that building or in the warehouses on the other side. It's kind of tough to gauge with the way they run and move around.
Hell yeah. I'm ready for some action, Mad Dog. I just spent... How long? Oh. Well, they're not shooting at me. They must still be out in town. They moved fast. Snafu, 300 AAC rounds. I found another one of those four grips. Hell yeah, buddy. I sure as shit do want it. M4 carbine vanilla. I like how they had to qualify it as a vanilla rifle. There's our car, so the gate is just over there. There it is. There's our warning. Oh, are you serious? Now I'm getting massive lag spikes. Arrow muzzle. Mad Dog, don't fuck with me while these guys are out running around. I just heard their footsteps. That zombie didn't seem bothered by him, though. It almost sounded like they ran through the first floor.
that really did sound like they ran just straight through the first floor. Oh, he fucking tagged me once. Dick bag. Come on now. Come on now. Those gotta be zombies. This motherfuckers ran up around the balcony and came in through this fucking door. What they have? Trash. Are you fucking serious? Ugh. I had him. How many shots did I put into him? I fucking had him. Nice. That other asshole is still around somewhere. Ah oh, damn, this thing takes forever to use. What the fuck? Yeah, I know I'm sick. Every time I use one of these fucking kits, I get fucking blood poisoning. Then I gotta go buy that special injector every time.
I thought it was just the CMS kit. Take the pills. The pills aren't going to help, which fucking sucks. Sucks big time. Oh. Fucker. We forgot to buy shotgun shells. I did drop that fucking guy. There he is, right there. Fucking anus. With the SA-58, of course. Why wouldn't it have been an SA-58? Oh yeah, I already searched the rest of this joint. I'm not too concerned about the uh, blood poisoning. We can get back to the trader and get the injector. It's more of a... an inconvenience than anything else. Just a pain in the ass. Because the... Constant whinging. I found another honey badger. That's nice. I like a honey badger. Honey badger, don't give fuck. Mm. 
Denmark 2, AK-12, Trigy Doctor, ACR, is there anything around the corner? No. I think we came out of this door, right? Pretty sure. Pretty sure. IA2. T5000 mag. So, the T5000, the Orsis rifle, it's bolt action. But if you're good with a bolt action, or if you could train yourself to be good with a bolt action, that rifle is super sick. Like, out of control. It's a bad motherfucker. We're gonna have to finish up here quick though. We got this building and one more. The faster we finish and get out of here the better because those boys are gonna be respawning here pretty quick. Hell yeah. Pick some free 338. Ollie! Hey, buddy. Good to see ya. Glad you're here. Same one we were playing on, buddy. The Mad Dog showed us a money making trick. And, uh,. It's insane. With this one trick, you too can go from rags to absolute fucking riches. Oh, why, thank you. Mad Dog said I was going to be too visible. Look at this shit, though. Huh? I blend right in with the concrete. Visible my ass. Oh, I guess there were more than two buildings. Fuck. It's three more? Four, five? We can skip these two, though. There's never anything in them. Maybe some ammo. Those buildings have potential for rifles. I think we wiped out all the patrols here. Come on, man. Famous last words. I think we got all the patrols. What the fuck? Is this a traitor? I think I might know why that's here. <clears throat> this was probably going to originally be the... the trader location when they were... Programming the mod. Oh, Claymore. I bet that's exactly what it was going to be. This was supposed to be the traitor. 
until they decided probably shouldn't be in the military spot because it's it'd be blocking. No, I guess it wouldn't be blocking loot, but you'd be able to to sit and farm out. Well, this one was pretty sparsely loaded. Yeah, GPS. Mm. Alright, that's all for us. We came here, we did the thing. We almost died. Luckily, it was just a knockout. I think that's in part because of the, uh... Hey, hey! I'm gonna take that home. It's always nice to have a spare... Ollie just hopped on. Ollie, I am way in the south, man. There ain't a whole lot I can do to help you out. Not right now, anyway. I'm gonna go ahead and say that's not a direction we want to go just yet. Oh, they are shooting at us too. Okay, boys. Woo! Rounds are snapping right past our head. They gotta be able to see us, at least. They can't just blind fire through the woods. <laughs> Whoa! Wait, was that one right there? I saw a bush. I thought I saw a guy charging up across the field at me. Besides that, I swear I'm hearing a fucking suppressed shot coming from over here. Those are close! Where the fuck are they? There you are. Just making sure. I'll take that lighter. And your dog tags. God damn, man. The Kavari is beast. Seven six two by five four R. What was this guy rolling? A Mosin. Okay. That's acceptable. Mosin is respectable. Take all that shit. Why not? 
All right. Oh, yeah. I mean, that's the plan, Ollie. I want to hit the bunker. What I need to find first is the punch card. I had found one pretty close to, like, one of my first days on the server. I had found a punch card. But I didn't know what it was for, so I threw it away. I have not seen another one since. Yeah, we might have to team up on that. Since we're both running this server. And at this time of day... Oh, shit, almost blew my engine. At this time of day, there's nobody else on. So, we basically have free run of the whole place. Find them where? Convey. Where is convey? What do you mean convoy? And even then, what convoy? So I have not encountered any convoys. Oh, no, that's alright. Convoy. I don't know where those are. Oh, shit, before we forget. Yeah, need to buy those. Okay. I might try that out right quick. I just first need to... Finish selling these... Uh. Items. Fuck it. We got the money. Let's go down here. Uh. Let's see. Food poisoning? No. Cholera? No. Uh. Flu treatment? That's uh. not it. Kuru? Oh, it's not a food poisoning. It does say blood poisoning.
Ollie. Do you have a car? If you have money for a car, Ollie, I need you to come down here to Nadbor. The Mad Dog himself has shared with me a way for making money and rep. And I would like to share that strategy with you. You have enough money for a car. I think the Humvee is... Oh, you don't have enough rep to buy one. Yeah. Okay. Can you make it down here to Nadbor? The same thing I was just doing? You might be able to do it up there at uh, Radix, too. You buy the chicken from the, the vending machine, and then sell it right to the trader. I just made stupid amounts of money doing that. I don't know if the Radix trader has that quest. That's why I was trying to tell you to get down here to, um, whatchamacallit, Nadbor. Nadbor. Will this go on my backpack? No. It won't. Should keep a lighter on me. What the fuck is with the food? I think that has to do with the injections. Speaking of which... Propital. I think we need to start using Propitols. These Grizzly kits and the CMS kits, for some reason, are hot trash. And I'm not trying to buy... A 300 or 250k fucking blood poisoning every single time I use my CMS or Grizzly kit. Health injector. Completely restores a person's health. Okay, but it doesn't do anything for... Cuts. <laughs> Let's just run some bandages. A uh, couple more of those. The health injector is a million. The Propitol is 35k. Military issued drug stimulates regeneration processes by increasing biosynthesis of purine and pyrimidine bases, RNA functional and enzymatic cell elements. Increases metabolism, health, and vitality. I don't know if you know this, Ali. I'm as rich as God right now. <laughs> oh, these aren't the same 338s. Yeah, I know those all help with uh, the blood infection and all that, but 
uh, what I was getting at, the issue I was trying to correct was the fact that um, every time I used a Grizzly kit or a CMS kit to patch up a, a bleeding wound, I would get a blood infection. All right, so the medical shit's in my pants, and I'm trying to put it into my Mark V utility pouch. So let's hide all that. That way it's faster. Much faster. Providols in here too. And pilts. And IV bags. These IV bags are great for uh, regenning blood. I like them a lot for that. Uh, that's an epinephrine injector. Do I have any other... Well, that needs to go up to here. A sweet thousand rounds. That's already been stripped. Yeah. Ollie, it's all about how much time you want to devote to it. I think I put about an hour in earlier. Yeah, I'm almost certain it was close to a solid hour of hammering the, uh, whatchamacallit. Buying chicken here, going over there and selling it to him, coming back here. I think it was about an hour, hour and a half I was on it. So this round of gear cost I think about ten million dollars. And that's without the rifles. It's purely just the uh Is this got a tritchy doctor on it? Can I get this stock? Can I put that stock on the SA fifty eight? No. No, I cannot. It only takes the SA-58 stock. Fine! 25,000. 25,000 rep to buy the modded clothing. Take that up, put that in there. What are these? My 308s. I know I picked up a pile of 338 Lapua as well.
Do I have a lockpick? Oh my god, I didn't even bring a lockpick with me. What a fucking rookie. Oh, no, that's the helmet we just stripped. Hey, you can do it, man. Every time you sell a hundred chicken breasts to the trader, you got to do the mission 50 times. That's worth 5,000 rep. So, you take how much rep you're looking for. You probably have close to zero right now. Maybe a thousand. So you're going to need to do that five times. You sell a hundred chicken breasts to the trader five times, and you'll have your 25,000 rep. And each time you do it as well, each hundred chicken breasts is worth $2.5 million. So by the time you're done doing it five whole times, you should have $12,500,000, million, $12.5 million. Worth it. It's totally worth it. Now we got a storm dropping in on this leaky ass roof. I just gotta strip my mags, man. I want this ammo. So I forgot to grab some from the house where we started off today. And a pile of shotgun shells and a couple of piles of 308 that were just sitting there waiting for me. It's okay though. After this I'll be sitting on about 1500 308 rounds. I should try and I should buy a box of that snafu 338 as well they keep advertising it well I wouldn't say advertise they market the thing in the description as uh, the snafu ammo anyway being stronger than uh, expansion ammo. I'm gonna buy another IV bag, too. Uh, where's the ammo pouch? There you are. Get in there. What are these? 300 AAC. I keep those. Thousand rounds of three hundred AEC will get us back to uh, what we need to hang on to. 
if we need to stop at the house after a death and pick up uh, the honey badger. Speaking of which, we're going to have to get back to the house soon. You probably tuck some of this keepy shit into the car. Because the car is not going to go away. Well... The theme for today was rep farming. <laughs> Boy, did we farm some rep. What were we at? Close to like 16 or something like that? 15, 16,000? We're sitting at 60 now. This is obscene. Sixty thousand rip. I would definitely call that mission achieved. I'm trying to find where those three three eights went that I just took out. Did they stack? They did. 405. They stacked. What are you? 556. Five, 545. Five. There's the 338s three, three I picked up. Keep all those little boys together. I think one of them is, uh. Schnafu. Tuck the pants away, open the backpack again. I bet some shit ended up in there. Oh, and did it ever. Did we end up with two of them? Oh no, that shotgun in the backpack is just our shotgun. I think. Depends. Nope, that's got a full magazine. That's the one that we were going to put away. So, the one in our pants... Nineteen rounds yet. Yeah, that's the one that we want to hang on to and keep an eye on. That belongs over here. I knew something was missing. Start putting more food and drink in our uh, utility butt pouch. Keep that heli shit on us in case we find another one. How much fucking food did we take off these guys? I didn't think we grabbed all that much. Just couldn't stop myself, I guess. I think the rest of this we can sell. No, well, maybe not. Another 30 rounds of 300 AAC. You just keep grinding, Ollie. Keep grinding that chicken mission.
Yeah. Right, let's go sell the dog tags. What happened to the mercenary dog tags? Were they not wearing any? Where's my spare tire? Oh. New truck, who it is? That's going home. That's definitely a keeper. We don't want to accidentally sell any of the bits and bobs that are attached to any of these. Want to make sure to keep those nice and pristine and in check. Not selling Kavari or Thompson mags. one more scan make sure there's nothing else that could get confused I don't want to confuse the server start selling our good shit that's the armor Here's what we got in our shirt. Oh. Another can of food. I think we'll buy two more saline bags. And another prop it's all. Okay. Start at the top. I know I have one on my helmet. There it is. 30 round C mag. That's 556. Five, Those are gone. Optics. That's attached to my little pulled hammer scope. Which I think we're going to keep that. We can sell the mini sights because we can't put it on our revolvers. Sell those. Those. Here we go. HK417 mag. That's actually loaded up with 308. Or did I? I think I already stripped it. Why can't I sell this? Oh, it's attached to the Vanilla rifle. Okay. Okay. We gotta find that Kabar mag, wherever it's at, and strip it. I'm not so worried about 30 rounds. I hang on to those Trigy Doctors too in that Walther MRS. Arrow muzzle's gone though.
Hold up. Whatever. <clears throat> So the two plate carriers. Let's sell that one Falcon belt. Is there anything else? I thought there was more. I thought there was more. Military clothing. That was there. Sell those Mitches, Balaclava, and that plate carrier. Oh, and the holster. Is there anything in here? No. All right. There's the Gavar mag. Strip those rounds so we can sell it. What's this? Modified SA-58. Well, I didn't see this up for sale. And because it wasn't for sale, you know what that means. Nope. No, I wanted to take that to hands. Shit. I don't think this was even available for sale, was it? No. It sure the shit isn't. Okay, well... The handguard actually was. If the handguard was, I think the buttstock might have been as well. Oh! That's goofy as shit! Have I left the safe zone yet? You can't throw things! While inside the safe zone. Fucking Yetus. Where'd that magazine go? Where did it go? I got these boxes of 4.6 by 30 AP rounds, too. Where'd that fucking magazine go? There it is. Into the dump pouch. Yeet! Alright. Settled on keeping this, too. What is this? AK-19 muzzle. That wasn't available for sale. 
put some of this shit in a wooden crate. And these are optics that we're gonna keep. We got so many spaces. It's ridiculous. Uh, Claymore's a keeper too, why not? Let's go see what else we could sell. The attachments. Hand guards. Yep. Lights, no. Ammo, no. Mags. Yes, that one. Those two. That one. And then... Those. Sell one of those. Sell that one and buy a new one. So that wasn't for sale. I think I might keep these. They sound pretty tight. 4.6 by 30 AP rounds. Anything else? Oh, we're finally empty. Medical shit. Give me another one of these IV saline bags and another Propitol. We are geared to the teeth. We're geared all the way through our teeth. Was this? Nope. This was the one. It can go there. This one goes here. These go here. That goes there. That goes there. Honey Badger goes home. All right. Magazine loading. Gotta love it. I think our SA fifty eight was a little a little lacking. Nadbor base just got gas. Tight. Okay. At least I think it did. Something very nearby just got gassed.
something very nearby in this direction maybe this is that a military compound too that explosion came from this way and it was close oh the Kavari too yeah that's right No explosion this time. I wonder if I could see those mercenary fucknuts from here. Like the shitheads just uh running around down through there. Where's my Kavari mags? There's one. Uh, put these in the car. And the 300 AC. We ain't shooting it, we got no use for it. Let's see if there's a... Uh... 300 AAC drum mags that we could buy. Oh. Like this one right here. Uh. Fuck it, let's buy them in tan. Oh yeah, they work. That's hot. I put all that right there with the the badger. Hundred round badger mag. God damn. I said god damn. Alright. We're topped off on everything. What was on number six? Oh. My health shit. Let's put a band-aid on number six. Before we go, slam a can of pork in a front of lemonade. Keep that food and water up. Fuck it, let's just buy one. It's kind of nice to not have to worry about, uh, spending money. So long as we have 800 bucks, we can make millions. Look at that. 
2.35 mil. A 22.35 mil. Insane money. Right. Tuck those up so we don't have to look at them. I really wish this backpack had a fucking rifle slot on it. I like that it has 1200 slots, but I'd really like it more if it had... Where's Rustoka? There's Rustoka. So we leave the trader and get out to the main road and we could follow that down. To the paved left. Or, I guess we can't go straight across because of the quarry. But we can take these dirt roads and bypass the town altogether. I think that might be the, the strat. Bypass the town. Okay. So we're going to get out to this main road and we're going to make a second left. Right after I get up and return. Two seconds. <coughs> Back. Let's fill my cup too. We're not going to be on very much longer. Maybe an hour and a half ish. That'll uh, let us hit Rostoka. Maybe one more location. The first left. Whoa! Easy server. Easy.
Oh yeah, we want to keep on going. What a lovely drive through the woods. So it looks like we're going to break off and aim for up the hill and around the trees. Please tell me that's just fog and it's not covered in gas. That could be the other missile that we heard flying overhead. boys I don't know what that error is on the right hand side You guys see that? Is that like a mod error or something? Fuck the both of you.
Oh, fuck me. Oh. Fuck you. What the fuck? Okay. Good cover. Not good enough. What do we got here? Granite dog tags. Oh. Out of almost a full set. Mark 47, too, huh? Wow. Kavari Black. Wow. This guy was really, really humping for it. And I ruined all of their jackets. Look, another Kavari Black. Did I take the, the tags off that other fella? Nope. Show sure didn't. All right. I was getting it from both sides. Yeah, y'all can keep them fucking medical kits. Garbage ass things. There was a third. Where did he die? I genuinely can't rightly remember where I put the, the other guy down. Oh, there he is. Hi. Oh, shit. I just took his pack of ruined bullshit. Alright. That was fun. Let's make sure Kavari... Mr. Kavari is ready for the next engagement. Oh. I think I took a shot to my rifle. Fucking fix that. Thank God for pristine repair, too. Speaking of which, how's our other weapons doing? Okay. We do need to bail out of here before we get tagged again. So let's drive across the field directly to the west. And... Try to catch the road again. 
towards Huta. It's a decent amount of activity down this way. Guys wearing full NBC shit. Yeah, we got some distance to travel. We actually need to go a little bit this way. Fucking earplugs. Can't hear shit over the rain in that engine. We are going to go head up towards the house, though. And, uh... Deposit some of this stuff. Like this full set of NBC gear. And stop off again at the, the Radix Trader. Maybe meet up with our friend Ollie. What do you say, Ollie? Kind of like a plan there. All right, we need to go through these woods, so. Let's try and plot a nice, easy course through the trees, the happy little trees. Yeah, that's about the bearing we need. Then we just follow that road. Yep. Too easy. <clears throat> Can't hardly see shit, there's so much rain. Is there another military base up that way? Oh, I didn't even see we had another player join. How many people are on right now? Oh, just us again. Just us again, Ollie. Oh, one other thing, Ollie, too, is I can show you how to do the, um, the mission that's just down the hill from the Radix Trader. Those four guys in the house. If you'd like. The way I do it, I don't take any, any shots. I don't get even their aggro up. They just don't survive.
The last damage I did was to an AK-19 assault rifle. That means my round went through the rifle and still killed homie. I think that's Radix, isn't it? That is. Oh shit, almost drove into a fence. Go off into the field. We'll cross the bridge, we'll get to the house, we'll dump some of this shit and uh call it a day. Um recommending guns. Recommending guns. I would recommend no less than the caliber 300 AAC for your basic rifle, your primary. I would recommend no smaller than 338 Lapua for a sniper. And I would also recommend carrying a shotgun. Preferably one that has an automatic fire capability such as the AA-12 or the SN Auto Shotgun. I can't tell you how many times my life has been saved by 12 gauge firing at an extremely high cyclic rate. Outside of that, um, you carry what you want, man. Whatever makes you feel good. Off the earplugs. All right. So, this thing has some janky fucking sights on but it's got the choke. Oh. Well, that's going on my current gun. That's coming off, too. The fuck are these? Oh, I just took all this shit off those guys. That's right. <laughs> Where did you come from? Where are those other sites at? Backpack. Nope. Pants. That's the Walther MRS that I want on there. Tuck that away. Well, we're already rocking uh, the 60 round mag on this honey badger. 
And now we'll be able to rock the 100 round mags too. If we put a Trigy Doctor on it. There. Got an ammo box in here where we're stacking ammo. 300 AC. Three oh eight win. We're actually gonna hang on to that on our person. Stack it up this way. It looks neater. We're keeping these Kavari mags. That's for damn sure. Fucking mutts. I'm going to mute the mic. I think someone just got home. And it has the Night Force optic on it already. That's fucking phenomenal. We are so lucky we didn't get tagged by these fellas. So lucky. But you know where that one's going. Boom! Right there. Mark 47. With a Trigy Doctor. With the big old drum mags. Shit, yeah. Too bad we didn't keep that CQR grip. Mike's going off again. The reason we're keeping all those Kavari mags is because this rifle is stupid expensive. And those magazines are like 300k a piece. We're going to keep that one too. What's this? Ruined 556. Accidentally took that stuff. Toss some of this food in here. This IV bag. We're gonna tuck that up there with the rest of them. Get this out of here. Maybe. Jesus.
I think that's the only tool we had, but now we gotta find a spot for Mr. Claymar. Eh, he'll go right there. Oh, another IV bag. I cannot express enough how valuable those damn things are. Did that thing get ruined? Damaged. Damaged is not ruined. We do need to find somewhere, though, to tuck away this NBC shit. That works. Pants, shoes, mask, hood, gloves, <clears throat> all we're missing is the um jacket I guess we're missing the bag too is the bag empty? yeah fuck that bag I know we picked up another one too It's not going to throw very far, so we'll just toss it down. Ugh. Question really becomes, how many... How many full sets do we want to keep? You know what I mean? And at this point, we just need that. And we have two sets minus the, uh, the Hujima What's It's, the Watchima Who's It's. Oh, wait a minute. That's not the truck we want to get in the back of. This is... You know, honestly, with that truck just sitting there... It's, it's, it's a whole nother storage. Ollie! What guns did you go with, buddy? Did you buy them yet? I'm curious which ones you purchased. Oh. Okay. Actually, fuck that. Let's just put that in there as is. I think that's another one, isn't it? Yeah. Mech of our mag. Getting wrap. Get that wrap. SA-58, and it doesn't have a Trigy Doctor on it. That's a shame. All better. The 
VSSK deserves to have a hammer sight on it. Ugh. Stripping gear takes so much time. But most of the time it's so very worth it too. A big old block of cheese. All right, we got a survivor patrol coming through the area. There they are. I heard you fuckers. There you are. There you were. A 1A patrol. Was it really just him? No fucking way. What a dickhead. Come at me like that. Seriously? Almost wasn't worth my time to stop and engage. Oh, I forgot about that rifle rack. I can't believe they sent one guy out on patrol. That's booty. Okay, what else do we got that needs a stripping? Nope, that's taken care of. A 
could snag some more of these respirators off these masks. The uh, canisters, I should say. Should be one more mask. Oh no, no, that's right. We saved two of them. So there is only that last one. There's some morphine injectors, though. Another POX antidote. Those boys running through the gas. Okay, and those are all stripped. These flashlights are all stripped. Right, that's the sea chest on the floor. Give me that thing. And then should just be able to straight up hot swap. Yeah. Now we got a full full kit back on our truck. Repair items and all. We should snap this crate up too. How the hell do I get these crates out of here? Oh, I bet I know. Yep. Always on the side. For some fucking reason, it's always on the side. Is that the one? That's the one. And this can just be... Basic ass storage here. Jerry can full of water, radiator, spark plug. Yep. Tons of food, pills. That's the good stuff. I'm trying to think if there's anything else in here. That we could use. And we could just strip off all this shit too. No point. Let's start storing some of this other shit though. Put in this sea chest. Another gas canister. Hey, you know what? Fuck it. Let's just eat that cheese right now. We ain't gonna poop for days.
Oh wow, that's a quick snack too. Thought that would have been denser. There we go. I wonder how tight the shot is now. Trying to hit the earplugs. Let's see about dropping these fools over here in the bushes again. Get a little bit more of that free rep. And, uh... Some more dog tags to sell. These boys have them good tags. Your plug's off. Laces out, Dan. Boys. Oh, boys. the fuck are you? There's always some boys in the bushes. I would be willing to bet that they're not spawning here because we were doing all of that engagement down in the south. Oh well. Can't get them every time. Whoa! Whoa! I swear to god, the server lets you have cars, but it hates driving. That's why I gotta take it extra gentle across this bridge. It might hiccup and throw you in the river. Couldn't tell if there was friends over there. Hey, look who it is. Ollie.
start by selling off these weapons. Show me only the sellables. Oh, yeah. Those AK-19s are... gone. I fucking hate this shit. Five different other attachments. Where is it? Where is it? Oh, look at that. Remember that CQR grip that we were just talking about? Wishing we had kept? Yeah. Found it. Take that battery. And the rest of it can just go. Get my cool guy shit up here. Right, and then I need to throw this Thompson on the floor so I don't accidentally sell this one because this trader is fucking ridiculous. So the trader in Takistan... That guy is awesome. That trader is the shit. There isn't a guy... There isn't... Well, there is a whole bunch of goofy machines like this. But they also have... A barrel. A big fucking barrel. And what you do with that big fucking barrel... What you do with that big barrel is, you take everything you want to sell, you press it into that barrel, and then when you back out, it allows you to just sell it. Easy peasy. So you can bulk sell shit. And you don't have to worry about taking shit off and accidentally selling something that you wanted to keep. Hey, Ollie's looking relatively geared up now. Ollie looking geared up. You got some decent shit there, buddy. Let's see. Anything else? These falcon belts. That's money. Nope. Nothing else. Let's go down the way to the black market. Holy hell! Oh my god, look at the cost of those granite dog tags. Two hundred K from those NBC boys. Holy hell. That's fucking money.
Did we have anything else? I don't even know if I want to keep these, this band-aid in this heat pack. I guess I will. Everything else appears clear. Let's enjoy a damaged fronta. Check out Ali's gear. He's got himself a TT plate carrier. Is that the the RSAS and it's suppressed? Ooh. A tan RPK? Oh boy. He's got the Falcon belt. Yeah, with the nice MMG bottle. Okay. That, I think, is the Assault Pack. That's the 700 slot bag. Very nice. And he's got himself a Morphine and Propitol. Hell yeah, buddy. Very nice. Gestures. So we need... To remember F3 <laughs> and F9. Give him the thumbs up. Yeah, very nice. Nice gear. Hell yeah. Nice gear. There's a Tech-9 over here that you can sell, too. Not that he needs it. Dude is making crazy chicken money. Crazy chicken money. Stuck all these goodies in here. Wait, we don't have to worry about them. I wonder what his rep is up to now. Oh, he's got the cute little face mask, not the balaclava. I want to talk to this chick too. We are hungry and need fish. We are hungry and need chicken. So you can do these here at Radix too. You don't have to go down to uh, Nabor. 21k rep! Yes! Almost there. One more round of 100 chicken breasts and you'll have all the rep you need to buy everything available. I think there is, I believe, a rifle or two that's at like 35k. No, don't show me sellables. How much money do I got? 1.8 mil. The Ash 12, I think, is at 35k. I think. Um, actually, that's the only thing that, that gets me about the, the Ash 12. They're only 20 round mags. I would like it a lot more if they weren't.
Ugh. Yeah. I don't know. What do you think? Should we Ash 12 it? Just to give it a shot? I'm going to tuck this away in here. Along with all of these. And all of this. I think we should. I want to give that Ash 12 a shot. I want to see how how mean that motherfucker is. Customize. I don't think it's suppressed though. I don't think you can suppress it. Yeah, put the flashlight on it. Why not? Bye. Did that thing come with a magazine? I swear to Jesus, it better have come with a magazine. Where did it even go? Did it go right to my shoulder? It did. Oh, look at that. No mag. What? Huh? Huh? Tight. And no, there is no suppressor allowed. Can't even try. Do this the easy way. Hmm. Actually, actually, that's what we need. With these only being 20 rounders, I want to keep a lot more of them on me. Oh, good thing they don't take up very much space. They are expensive, though. Now we need an optic for it. This is where dragging and dropping multiple items at a single time would be optimal. Those SA-58 mags take up a lot of space comparatively. 2x2 two two instead of 1x2. Alright. We need... Optics. Hold on. Does it give us a description? It is a Russian rifle. Which... Who knows what actually attaches to it. Let's see if we can get an AK. I don't think an AK doctor would fit. Let's just try to get a Trigy Doctor on it. Yeah.
please. Yes! Now let's look at ammo. No. Boxes. There we go. Pretty sure that was some snafu 12-7. Yeah. Right there. Wait, I don't even think there's regular 12-7. I think the, the only 12-7 there is is snafu. Yeah, there's no expansion. And there's sure shit no regular. So these boxes here are all there is. Three? Three million per box. Holy shit. I am so happy we saved all of these. So we have a fuck ton of this at home. SHA. It's called the SHA here. It's called the Ash when you buy the gun. What is it? Google! Okay, well. I looked up SHA 12 and it showed me. A gun from Zero Sievert. Okay. So this is actually the SHAK-12. Originally under the name Ash 12.7. Okay, so the wiki article is... Pretty much what... the model here was built off of basically Ooh, the one on the wiki has a grenade launcher attached to it that's hot so it really is the SHA K12 fuck it ain't nothing but money we need a box of it let's put her on three put her on three Go to the shoulder. Went to the shoulder. Let's unwrap this. 200 rounds to get us through. Until we either get back to the house to collect more or... We find it on our travels. Speaking of which... That Kavari mag is looking a little empty. Oh. 25, not 20, guy. What was that? That looks cool, Lolly. The Ash 12. Let's see if there's any boys down here that need fixing just gotta wait for the timer to expire left the safe zone yeah you're right this thing looks bad as hell oh All right. So it's wildly inaccurate at range, but it is full auto. Hold on. What does a full auto burst sound like? Oh my god. Oh my god. That's hot. <laughs> I 
All right, let's make back some of our Ash 12 money. I'm going to say with the guy at Nadbor, it was easier. There's less on the list. Oh, I got all the bandits' attention out there. Speaking of... While I have their attention... There you are, boys. Yeah. Come on now. Come on now. Come on, leave the safe zone. Getting shot from the right, too. Damn. Oh, there he is. Way down the way. Oh, hey, buddy. Where are those suppressed shots coming in from? I can hear them wigging or just winging by me. Where was that other guy at? Where is yo buddy? Man, he wasn't that far out, was he? No, he couldn't have been this far out. We wouldn't have been able to engage him properly. I don't know, maybe he was this far out. Was he already over this fence? Where did he go? The ugly jerk. Oh. They're shooting at me from the fucking checkpoint. Hear the rounds? They're impacting short. Those gotta be coming from the checkpoint. That I can't rightly see right now. Oh. Maybe not. Get fucked. Go on. Where's your friend? Oh, he was right close to the fence, too. It sure as hell wasn't this guy. Could it have been? No, he wouldn't have been rocking an MPX and something else. What the hell? Oh, there he is. Alright, I'm somewhat happy with that ash. I wish it wish it didn't have super high muzzle rays like it does, but
That thing's a damn killer. I swore that other guy was right near this fence. No, he sure as hell wasn't this close to me. He wasn't far, but he wasn't close either. Oh, there he is. Wrong fence. Cool. Oh! Ollie! Very nice. He made the 25k rep. Now you need to get some serious guns, son. That RPK ain't gonna cut it. <laughs> yeah! Forgot we still have this inventory full of chicken. We were in the middle of uh, making money and crazy rep. All the soldiers at Glaniska Airfield. Yeah. Sure. Let me get right on that. How many more of these do we have? <laughs> Look at her, she put her hand up. Hey, 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 boys, one at a time, one at a time. No.
You know what we should do, though, is see if we can actually buy an NBC jacket. Yo, that's why they smoked us so hard. The geared NBC soldiers. So these boys that we just took out in the field here, that, uh, were very lucky. We were very lucky to not get hit by. They were rocking the Kavaris as well, which is what we got murdered by at the end of the airfield in that, uh, that farmer's patch. Uh, maybe I didn't need to buy a hundred. Oh, that's it. We hit the bottom. There we go. Uh, was there any other leftovers we took from those guys? The belts and balaclavas. That's right. All right, Ollie, what guns do I have? Firstly, I'm rocking around with this Smith & Wesson Model 500 competition. I've got oop, a suppressed Thompson Mark II for up close and personal. It's my backup in case I get swarmed by zombies and my SA runs out of ammo. But I'm not using the SA anymore. Now I have the Ash 12.7. This mug. She slaps. I've also got an SN auto shotgun for the bots when they trap me in a building. And I've got the Kavari. Reach out and touch somebody. I need to get back up to the house. They fucked my door up. We took a shot to the door somewhere. Jerks. Now I need to buy a new one. Penises. SUV parts. Sell. Front left door. Blue. There we go. All better. I don't want to have any money on me. Keep it all in the bank. Back to the house.
It's already five o'clock in the afternoon. For me, anyway. I'm gonna have to log off here. This was a fucking blast, but it's also my last day of vacation. My regular weekend is tomorrow and Friday, and then I go back to work on Saturday, so... I got a few things I gotta get done today. I gotta go to the store and such. Adult things. Fucking adulting. And, uh... Get some of my uniform gear together, properly put together for uh, when I go back to work on Saturday. Let's just go park this at the house, get ourselves inside, and then log off. Let's see if these boys are out here, though. Oh, they're out here. <laughs> you all suck. Can't hit the broadside of a barn. Where are you? Seriously, where the fuck those shots come from? They're usually right up in the... Oh! That guy was walking like a zombie. My old gun, the uh, SA-58. It's in my truck, so just give me a second. I'm going to strip these guys out so we have something to sell next time. Damn, that got hit bad. Can't forget his rifle. SA. Sam Adam. SA 58. I'll show you in a second. It's pretty kitted out. You gotta look for a few different things like the uh, CQR foregrip. Helps balance it, keep it stable. All right, <clears throat> back to the truck to show Ali. Yeah, the SA-58 is a pretty monster 308 rifle, especially when you combine it with the uh, 75 round mags. It's pretty tight. Here's my old lady here. So I've got. The Cordura Suppressor, the Trigicon Doctor, the uh, Snafu CQR Foregrip, and then the SA-58 Drum Mag, Those, along with a flashlight, of course. And that shoots 308 ammo. Which is pretty, f pretty easy to find. She's a little beast, though. Not terribly accurate, over a hundred, hundred and fifty meters. No, not even terribly accurate, over seventy-five meters, I guess. But uh, great fire rate, real stable, and uh. Shoots really, really well. To be completely honest, I think I'm stuck on it. Considering... I handled those boys with the Kavari.
Yeah. Yeah, I do believe. The Ash-12 is kind of cool. It would be... Definitely effective. In a, uh... CQB situation. You know what I mean? Like, real close quarters battle type of shit. But, um... Running around military bases, airstrips, things like that. I think I want the the accuracy of the SA-58. So I'm going to put the ash away for now. Oh, wait a minute. We also need that. No, stop it. There we go. Locker up. Seriously? Well, the last time those boys were over this way. I wonder if that's going to stay true. This shot sounded like they were... Coming from behind me. They were. I think they're in those trees right next to my shed. Oh. No, fuck that. They are way out there. Come on. <laughs> Dingus. Oh, he actually tagged us. He got us bleeding. And then there's this guy. Not anymore. Alright, it was labeled as a 2A patrol. So I think that means there's only two of them. Hi. Survivor, huh? No, hero tags. Dickhead. I don't need any of that shit. What I do need is to try and find your buddy, though. Where the hell was he? Probably over here. He was strafing. Looks like he was on this road. I mean, the whole patrol was on this road. There he is. AK-308. Huh. Oh! Hi! Nice backpack, bro. 
Then he gave us some more SA-58 mags. How nice of him. Next time. Fuck with somebody else. Let's just make sure those shots actually went in. There we go. That is such a loud round. <laughs> oh my god, it is so loud. Yes, we should have did this before we walked away from you. But, uh, yeah, better late than never, I guess. Hopefully have space for these Ash-12 mags. Yeah. We got the space. Then we put the Ash over here on the gun rack. There's our baby. My baby! I think we had a shit ton of ammo on us, too. I know we had more than just that... 1,000 rounds. There it is. And we got 3,000 rounds of Tracer. And... What was that? 400 rounds? 440? Of basic... Which... It's gonna be a lot more. We're stripping these mags out. Or should we? Do we have any more... SA-58 mags anywhere? I don't think we do. Oof. Yeah, we want to keep those. Keep them nice. Put it on the shoulder. See real quick if there's anything else we want to keep. Perhaps these morphines. And some more pilts. Put the poopsies in here. Cans of food. Ooh. We should find a spot for that backpack. That would be something neat to keep. Oh, yeah. We got this whole big old storage box right here. That's all it's fucking good for anymore. Yeah, I really don't get these boys most of the time. They run around rocking these, uh...
they run around rocking these badass belts and shit. But then they never have anything on them. Ollie, is that you? Is that you out there? Busting caps? I think I can hear you from here. <laughs> if you were just shooting, Ollie, you gotta tell me, what were you shooting? Or are, are you on your way to the house? My house, anyway? Were you on your way up to my house? Holy fuck! Seriously? I can hear those shots from where I'm at. Unless that was the airstrip boys. That might have been the airstrip boys. That would have to be the airstrip boys. There's no way that I could hear those shots from up here. It's almost two kilometers. Trying to put a Propital on 10 so I can pop that if I need. Right, I gotta put this last SA mag away that I stripped out of that AK. I had to start collecting some AKM mags for this Mark 47, the drums. So Mark 47 is a beast. Absolute beast rifle. We're going to keep that CQR grip on the ash because we might end up using that again. God damn, if we put a bipod on this, I bet that thing would be stupid stable. I'm gonna go with the CQR grip, though, because it looks fucking cool. So fucking cool. And then we're gonna suppress the motherfucker, too. Because why not? ARM4, 15-inch rail. I wonder if we can buy an Elvoa rail. Whatever. That's all for next time. You guys have been amazing. Not just today, not just the other couple of days. You guys have been awesome all the way around. I love you guys, the Wrecked Crew. You, you're so awesome. Genuinely, all your views, shares, comments, subs. I, I can't express enough how much I appreciate that. You guys have no idea how much it means to me. If you did like what you saw and you are new, please feel free to hit that like button. Hit the little bell icon too. Hit the, the notification bell. That way, when we go live or put up a new video, you get that, that notification right away. Which, every Saturday, Monday, and Wednesday is when new videos go up. We do Snow Runner on Saturday, Seven Days to Die on Mondays, and Daisy Takistan on Wednesdays. The Takistan map is pretty damn awesome. We're not even, we're kind of close to as geared on Takistan as we are here, but we're not even 
in the same ballpark, really. The economy is much different there. Um, yeah. I hope all of you have a great and safe rest of your day. I know I'm going to be out there on the road, so wish me luck. Afternoon rush hour, it's going to be crazy. Yeah, be safe out there. Love you, bye!